Hi everyone, my name is Marissa and welcome back to Al Canada's YouTube channel. Today I'm giving you a little sneak peek inside the shoot that Al Canada did in their November issue with the cover star Gigi Hadid. I absolutely love the makeup look and I think it totally suits her as well as it suits more of an autumnal feel for makeup, but I was blown away by the nail look. I'm wearing it right now. It's actually not too difficult to get, so I'm going to take you through the steps today on how to get a nude nail with the directional, either horizontal or vertical lines. Much like how a foundation provides a perfect blank canvas for your face makeup, a foundation for nails, a base coat, provides the perfect blank canvas for your nail art. This is the Essie Grow Faster Base Coat, and what it does is it provides a barrier between the nail polish and the nails. It helps prevent them from damage, and it also provides more of an even coating for your nail polish color to go on top. Gigi's nail artist, Leanne Polly, used the Maybelline Color Show nail polish in Neutral Statement. This is an excellent pinky nude beige that gives you instant elongated fingers, instant mannequin hands as we like to call them. With so many layers, it's essential to let each coat dry. A favorite tip of mine is to place your nails into a bowl of cold water. I add an ice cube to make it even colder for about 30 seconds and this helps to solidify the polish. I do this directly after I've painted the coats of nail polish. After two even thin coats of neutral statement, I put on my favorite quick drying top coat. I can't stress enough how important it is to let your nails at this point dry completely before starting with the accent to the nail, the black line. There are many different ways that you can paint on a thin straight line, but what I did was I used scotch tape as a stencil. Taking two pieces of tape for each nail, I just cover all the parts of the nail except for that thin line. So when I paint it over with a black nail polish, the only thing that would be left after I peel the tape off was that thin black line. The black nail polish that I used was the Essie Nail Lacquer in Licorice. This is great because it's just a streak-free, one-shot application. I only used one coat and it was an amazing intensity of color right away. Leanne Colley also suggests painting the nail polish directly onto a clear tape and then cutting it with nail scissors into thin little strips and then gently pressing those onto the nail once everything is dry. After all of that has dried, then I will go ahead and take my top coat one more time and paint it over top. And you're done. As you can see, there are many layers. It requires being a little bit careful, especially when putting the line on the nail, but I think that it's a very easy and doable, wearable look. And it's just something that's really graphic and chic. So that's it today for the tutorial on Gigi Hadid's nude nail with the black vertical and horizontal stripes. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to leave a comment and like the video. Also, subscribe so you don't miss any more of the videos in the series. If you decide to recreate the look, make sure to let us know by tagging at El Canada and at Marissa Roy on Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook. We are fast approaching my most favorite beauty time of the year, which of course is Halloween. I am obsessed with costume and theatrical makeup. So make sure you stay tuned, keep subscribed to this channel so you don't miss out on what the beauty editors and I have planned for Halloween looks.